you're going to be guessing which foods have had microplastics discovered in them. God damn it. Okay, so little bits of plastic. Okay. <laughs> Am I gonna die from doing this? <laughs> to find microplastics. Yes. So microplastics are plastics that are smaller than the size of a grain of rice. These tiny pieces of plastic then trickle down into our ecosystem. And the thing with plastic is it doesn't go away, it just breaks down into smaller and smaller pieces. Yikes. Is microplastic dangerous in food? We don't know the ramifications yet. It can't be good, right? Yeah. <laughs> that's, that's the moral of this. You can't just go eat a bunch of Legos and then nothing will happen. So we can taste it. I feel like I taste the whole sea. I taste the whole sea. The whole sea. Ooh, this oh. got plastic in it. I would guess that this is a scenario where the fish are in the ocean, there's a F ton of plastics in the ocean. There's no way it's not gonna have microplastics. They're going to eat plastic. I believe there was microplastics in that. I'm gonna say no, just because if you get it wrong, then I get it right, so let's just go for it. You're correct. There have been trace amounts of plastic discovered in fish. I'm not happy because of that. I'm happy because I was right and she was wrong. <laughs> like in the flesh, in all, testable parts or like in its bowels. So it's been discovered in fish bowels and fish livers. People can't be mad that there's plastic in their food if you're gonna put it in the water. The salt? I bet every other one of these little ball things is a piece of plastic. Yes, I think so. Because salt comes from the ocean too, right? A sea salt or a kosher salt might be different. Does that matter? Is it like part of the machining process or? I'm starting to think that this is a trick and everything has microplastics in it. <laughs> Me too. I'm gonna say yes. I mean, this just looks like plastic, doesn't it? Oh my God, I'm gonna be wrong, so. I say yes. no. Yes. There has been plastic found in salt. Oh. Hey! Now why are you twerking? We're eating plastic! I don't eat a lot of salt, so I'm still, I'm still good. <laughs> There's salt hidden in a lot of things. I love milk. apples, y'all. I can't wait for them to ruin this for you. Some fruit is coated with wax, right? Is there some plastic in that wax, some residual sh how do you know this? It's safe to assume that there's a little bit of something everywhere. Everything has plastic in it. I'm not surprised that this has plastic. I say yeah. There are. I agree. I like to say no. I like yeah. to say fruit is uh, water with fresh water from the river where there's also plastic. Oh, sh <laughs> Just as a gambling person, I think we've had two yeses in a row. I'm gonna go no. You're right, like a test. There have not been trace amounts of microplastics okay. found in apples yet. Feels good to eat some plastic-free fruit. I mean, let's not get started on the pesticides and stuff like that. Dude. Oh yeah. Who knows what we just ate? <laughs> <Right>? <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. Well, no beer comes in plastic containers. We know that, right? I think no. I'm gonna say no, because I really want to believe there's no plastic in beer. I'm gonna say yes. Something about like linings and cans or something. No. I'm gonna go with yes. Um, actually, read an article. Y'all didn't know she's cute, educated, and woke. Actually can be some traces of plastic in your favorite beer. Round of applause for Joyce, so. everyone. So I guess that's a yes? Yes. <laughs> See, she's educated, funny, and smart. I mean, the alcohol will kill you before the microplastics does. That's for sure. The alcohol should kill the microplastic. You would hope so, but... Knowing there's plastic in beer, do you care? I would have to understand which brands are contaminated with it because I, I have a feeling that I'm already selectively not drinking those because I don't like cheap beer. Sorry, bougie taste. The stuff we do to cows is messed up. There's almost certainly some plastic in there. Though what you're saying is true, I want to say no. <laughs> We're all doomed, it's probably yes. Wow, I haven't had real milk in a while. What is that, 2%? I've always been confused about the percents. Is the percent of plastic? I don't think so. I'm gonna say probably. Yes, it's been found in milk too. How? It's always been a little weird that we drink milk anyway, so. Ooh. This has microplastics in it. <laughs> I wanted to say I have tasted plastic in water before. There's nothing worse than a weird tasting water. Mm. You're like, Ugh. Like what is, like, oh, uh, how do plastics even get in here, you know? Cause when I think of plastic, I think of like plastic. <laughs> yeah. I don't think of liquids. I don't think of something I can chew and swallow effectively. I want to say no, but at this point, I've been proven wrong multiple times. So yes, 
It's gotta be. Yeah, it's probably got. Is this spring water? If it's spring water, I would say, I've been wrong this whole time. We'll just go yes. I think it's in the water. Researchers sourced tap water from all around the globe and microplastics were discovered in 81% of those samples. That's brutal. Well, there has to be somewhere in the world you can go where tap water is okay to drink. I feel like humans, we're so bad that we're probably not gonna try to get plastic out of our food. We're just gonna try to like come up with a, a way to make us immune to plastic, like a vaccine. Yeah. I mean, we treat the earth like garbage. We'll start like making food on Mars where it's like 100% no plastic, and then we import food from other planets. That'll be like the ultimate organic level. It wasn't even made on Earth. I'll probably buy it. We can't even really tell what's natural and what's not anymore. There's no yeah. way having plastic in your body is good for you. I'm sure over time, too, there's some serious ramifications. If you're worried about plastic, something you can do is try to refuse single-use plastics by carrying reusables with you.